He refused to stay to hear the sentence. Jean-Marie Le Pen left Party HQ as his daughter chaired the disciplinary meeting to decide on his fate. To reporters, he said, of course he wasn't giving up. He'd die first, and he'd continue to speak out when he wanted. But inside HQ, the axe fell. In a statement, the party said that it had been decided to suspend its own founders' membership, pending the convening of a special party congress in the next three months. This would decide on his role as honorary president of the party. There's no mistaking that the new leadership wants this role removed. Reacting on a French radio station, Jean-Marie Le Pen took the stakes even higher to the family. He said he no longer wanted his daughter to carry the name Le Pen. He said he recognised no ties with a woman who had betrayed him in so scandalous a fashion. Jean-Marie Le Pen is furious at the way he's been treated. But for his daughter, this is an opportunity. By putting politics above family, she has shown a steely determination worthy of her father. Hugh Scoville, BBC News, Paris.